Hey guys, it's KJ for you, and welcome to a special Let's Play, a brand new Let's Play for a game called Banished. Um, Banished just came out today, uh, February 18th, and um, yeah, I've been watching this game on YouTube for like a few weeks now because some people got uh, early access copies, and this is not an early access game. This game is completely released. It's uh, $19.99 or $20, however you like to look at it, on Steam, and this is kind of like a village town building type game uh, with an emphasis on survival. Um, there's no combat in the game whatsoever, and uh, you just build up your village and you try and survive. You make sure you have enough firewood uh, for the winter, you make sure you have enough food, and uh, yeah. I know a little bit about it, I haven't played it yet, but I have been watching a lot of videos on it, so this is, I wouldn't call this a blind let's play, but it's kind of an early, you know, I don't quite have a grasp on the game yet, so uh, let's see how it goes. Start a new game, and we will call it Cage Town, because I'm not in original. Uh, terrain type, let's go with valleys. Terrain size, uh, we'll stick with small. Climate fair is fine, disaster is on, and starting conditions medium. I'm not. Oh, let's start with hard. I actually heard it's hard as a hard game begins with four families, a small amount of clothing, food, firewood. I'm going to start with hard. So, this, yeah, this game does have uh, cycles, uh, you know, um, like, uh, what are they called? Uh, weather cycles, you know, autumn, June, summer, winter. Now, we're going to start off here, and the first thing we're going to do is figure out how to pause the game. There we go. Um, that is really loud, isn't it? Uh, let's turn everything down. Because the volume in this game's, uh, you know, as with any Let's Play I do in the beginning, the volume and the sounds are going to be a bit, you know, I'm going to have to work with them. Let's see how that is. I can live with that. Okay, so we're paused. You got a little control thing right here that controls time. You can play at one speed. You can jack it up to go as fast as you want. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go with tools and reports. This is okay. These are some stats. These are basically like your UI, and they start completely off. But I'm gonna turn them on. Right here is my town. We're in early spring. I have eight adults, zero students. You can actually build schools and educate your people, and six children. Um, adults can work. Children are useless uh, until they grow up. This is the uh, temperature, 37 degrees. I'm not sure if that's Celsius or Fahrenheit. Uh, not really sure. Uh, we got amount of stored logs. We got amount of stored stone, iron, tools, clothing, medicine, coal, firewood and food okay so we start here with just a uh, a storage cart with some with which is basically all these items they're just in this storage cart right here the first thing we're gonna do is uh, well we want that up uh, the events log this is kind of like tells you what's going on I'm gonna put this right down here like as a chat uh, I don't really need a mini map all right these are professions as you uh, as, as you basically as you um, build you know, things in the game. You need people to work those items. Like, uh, laborers basically transport material. They cut down trees, remove stone, like basic stuff like that. Builders build stuff, roads, farms, you know, not farms, but uh, roads, buildings, all that kinds of stuff. Farmers are farms. And, you know, each one has, you know, a certain amount of stuff to do. Let's take a quick look at our map over here. You move around to WASD. And, okay, one of the first things I'm going to want to make, uh, I think these are all the UI things I'm going to want up. Uh, one of the first things I'm going to want to make is storage. So let's go ahead and make a stockpile. Um, now, okay, so there's a, there's the, one of the major things I want to build in this game in the beginning for food is a, a gatherer and a hunting lodge. Um, hunting lodge is for deer, and I think there's some deer over here. This might be a good spot for the hunting lodge. Um, I think you want the hunting lodge near woods, but I'm not quite sure. I think I'm gonna just going to make a hunting lodge right here. Uh, maybe over here. I don't see any more deer. Uh, maybe, maybe we'll make the hunting lodge right here. I'm not really sure. I wanted to get this these deer, though. Um, and the other thing is the gatherer. Now, the gathering hut, uh, you want to put in woods. So, I do need to clear some woods for, you know, my buildings and stuff, but I think I'm going to keep these woods the way they are, and I'll build the hunting lodge up there, or the uh, gathering thing up there. So the first thing I'm going to make is the stockpile, and uh, I'll just make a quickie stockpile right here. Um, I don't think stockpiles cost anything to make, so we'll have a stockpile right there. And then we will come over to... Let's see what we got here. 
food. Okay. So you can make crop fields, you can make orchards, you can make pastures, fishing docks, hunting cabins, and gathering hut. So let's make the gathering hut like right... How do I turn them? Okay, how do I turn these? Uh, that I don't know. Okay, I built that there and I'm not sure I wanted to. I am going to have to figure out how to turn stuff. Uh... It's kind of weird, I can't figure out how to turn stuff. Give me a sec, I'm going to have to figure out how to turn buildings, so I'll be right back. Okay, so the to turn structures is um is uh, R and T. So i got to ma not make that item or whatever. So let's see, we got uh cancel, removal, remove roads, collect iron, collect stone, harvest trees, remove, remove resources, remove structure. Um... There we go. Okay, we removed it. All right, so let's try that again. Gathering hut, and it's R and T. So there we go. I want it to face this way. Not that it really matters, but I just want it to face that way. All right. Now, in order in order to craft that thing, we have to uh, put some people on builders, and um, I should also make a hunting a hunting cabin. Um, I don't see any animals over here. They say to build. Ooh, there's some animals. All right, so let's make the hunting cabin over here. They say to make the hunting cabin away from your city because animals will, like, not go near your city and stuff. So, hunting cabin. And let's make that facing this way. Not that it really matters. Yeah, it's uh, as good a spot as any, I guess. All right, so let's start the game and see what happens. This is going to be very trial and error for me, guys. So, uh, let's see what's going on. Oh, you know what? Before we do anything... Let's also set up to cut down some trees and clear some areas. Oh, we also need houses. Uh, okay, let's make some houses. We got um, wood houses, stone houses, and boarding houses. Let's go ahead and make a few houses right here. Uh, let's have them face this way. And then we'll turn them around and have these face that way. Four houses should be good. All right, let's see how uh, people handle this. Uh, I don't expect to do very well in my first uh, iteration of this game, but um, you never know. We'll see. Let's put most people on his... Oh, we're going to have to have people cutting down trees as well, remove area. So let's come over here to town service. No. Removal and destruction. Remove structures. Remove resources. Okay. So right here you have iron. Right here you have stone. And in here you have trees. I'm just going to remove everything in this area. Maybe. There we go. And we'll leave a couple more laborers. There we go. Four builders, four laborers. Let's see how that goes. Alright, so there they go. They're coming up here, up here to build the uh, the gathering thingy, my bob. These guys are coming down here and cutting down trees. Nobody's working on the houses yet. As you can see, these little housing icons over their head mean that means they want housing. But I don't expect that to be too much of a problem. Let's maybe put a couple more builders on. All right, six. Oh, okay. There are weather effects that kind of obscure your vision, and I do want to turn that off. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that uh, as I figure it out. Video. Render, full screen, uh, shadow resolution, shadow quality, reflections. Okay, maybe it's not that. Game, here we go. Edge scrolling, auto, show show weather effects. There we go. Don't want weather effects, they just obscure the view. So, alright, so these guys have removed some area resources from over here to make room for the uh, gathering hut. And these guys are removing these resources because that's what I told them to do. We only have two laborers. Um, I don't know why people aren't... Oh, we don't have any logs. That's the problem. They're not building the houses because we don't have any logs. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's cancel removal. And what we'll do is we will set them up to only remove trees. There we go. Alright, now, if you have builders, farmers, herbalists, 
gatherers, fishermen, whatever, and they don't have anything to do, they default to laborer. So if there's not enough uh, logs to build a structure, um, your builders will default to labor, and you know as long as you're cutting down trees and stuff, they should do that. These guys are out here. I don't know why they're. Let's cancel. Let's cancel removal down here. Cancel. All right. I just want them cutting down the trees, and the trees are set up for removal. Um, this is going to be a very rough start for me because uh, you know I have watched some videos about this game, but uh, yeah. The reserve of stone is low. I don't know what we would need stone for. Do we need stone for houses? Yes, we do. Or is that iron? I think that's iron, actually. Alright, so... What we'll do is we'll come up here, and we will remove stone. Just to get some stone. Because I do think we need some stone. Now, they are building... It looks like they're going to build a gatherer's hut first. I'm not sure which they're going to build first. I'm not quite sure their priorities. Now, we don't have any... Uh, we don't have anywhere to put this stuff. Uh, well, they do have... Up here... We should probably build a barn. Storage. Let's build a storage barn. Oh, boy. That's big. Alright, screw it. I think this is going to go very badly. I probably should have started off on a better difficulty, an easier difficulty, but, uh, yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and remove some more stone from over here. Uh, what she do? We do have idle villagers, I think. What are you doing? No, not remove structure. How do I look at what she's doing? There we go. Alright, uh, they, my, my guys have no tools. Tools basically I increase their efficiency. Uh, what is she doing? Name, age, cloth, tools, job. Oh, she's a child. That's why she's not doing anything. Yeah, they're ch children. Okay. Are you guys building anything? What are you doing? Oh, we got some uh, uh, mushrooms here. So that's pretty cool for the gathering hut. Uh, it looks like we have a... A lot of iron. Yeah, a lot of iron. Not a lot of stone. Oops. Ugh. I keep heading escape to get out of there, but there's some stone. Now, I think in order to build the structure, what they'll do is they bring all the materials over to this area, and then once they have enough materials, they'll start, they'll start building it. You can see right here. Uh, I need to remove these trees. It needs some logs. It needs more stone. And it needs a certain amount to build. So, it's actually... that. <laughs> it's going to be hard to remember not to hit the uh, escape button. All right, let's take a look at the housing. Let's see what's going on with the housing. Um, oh, God, they haven't even started. No, they have started with some of it. All right, so they're doing their job. I've got things queued up. Let's speed this up a little bit. Okay, there is a house being built. Um, yeah, I think if I, I think season, there's gonna be a lot of seasons in this game. Uh, apparently this is a very difficult game, uh, and I expect to lose quite handily, uh, you know, pretty badly. Uh, this needs more stone. There's stone, where's this stone? There's not a lot of stone over here, a lot of iron. Is there a lot of stone over here? No. Alright, we gotta remove some more stone. There we go. Get rid of that stone, guys. Alright, there we got a house. So somebody's got a house. Oops. Uh, how do we get rid of that? Uh, like this. There we go. No, I don't want to do that. I want to look in the house. Okay, so right here is a wooden house, and you can see uh, two people have moved in. Uh, we've got Dem Demer and Aberline. Aberline? Something like that. And uh, they're both builders, and they live there together, uh, male and a female, so they hopefully will have children. Uh, they've got firewood and potatoes for food. So that's how it works. You know, they need they need their firewood and potatoes and stuff for food. I thought I had all these houses facing forward, but it doesn't look like their front doors are facing forward. Oh, no, that's, that's their front door. Okay, good. It's fine. There's the gathering hut. Okay, hold on. Let's pause this. So here we go with the gathering hut. Now, in order for the gathering hut to work, you need to put people on the gathering hut. So uh, let's just put two people in the gathering hut. 
We'll take off two builders. So we have two laborers, two gatherers. We should probably do four gatherers for food. Yeah, because it's our only food income so far. So two builders, four gatherers. There we go. And now the gathering hut should start doing its thing. Now, gathering huts you want to leave in the woods. Um, not quite 100% sure if it's imperative to leave them in the woods, but I've been told that by, you know, a few people, and it actually says it on the wiki as well. So, there we go. We got some houses, some more... Whoa, four people live in this house. A couple kids, and a mommy and daddy. All right. So, they're doing good. We got the hut over here. So I did set up the hut. That's going to be a last priority, which is fine. Um, all right. So, right here... These houses are cold because they don't have firewood. Uh, I need to set up a specific thing for firewood. Is it a town service? Well, schoolhouse, hospital. No. Mm. Is it a resource production? Probably. Woodcutter. Used to chop logs into firewood. Okay, so there we go. Uh, where do I want to put that? I should probably start building some roads. Yeah, let's build some roads. Roads and buildings. Let's just make a dirt road straight through here. Ooh, I made these houses too apart. That's a mistake. Alright, well, whatever. Uh, I guess I'll make two roads just because why not. Alright. And then we will make a woodcutter. So we turn the woodcutter like that. And basically what you do is you put those little green arrows on your road. That's where I made my mistake. Oh man, this is not... The stupid cart thing is in the way. Alright, we'll just have this go down this way. And then we'll put the woodcutter... Here. There we go. Alright, that's a good place for the woodcutter. Now, I wonder if there's a way for me to make that woodcutter a, um... How do I get that thing off my... I don't know how to, like, get the, uh... The buildings off your hot... Off your mouse once you've made them. But we'll worry about that later. Alright. So, are they building this? It doesn't look like they're worrying about that. Hopefully they're building the woodcutter. I'd kind of prefer the woodcutter to get priority. I don't know if there's a way for me to make it priority. Um, but I'm just going to hope they make it a priority. Alright, so... Enable or disable production... Th oh god, I didn't even enable this. Okay, well there you go. <laughs> Oops. Uh, in order to make the gathering hut, you got to hit the little work button, I guess. Show our hide production stats at this location. Center view on this location. Current season. Actually, I'm not quite sure what that does. Work is disabled. Okay, so I, I disabled work there for some reason. But it doesn't matter because we're actually, get, we're actually getting stuff. We're getting roots, onions, mushrooms, and berries. Food is low on this map, and I don't know what I can do about that. Uh, maybe I need more builders. I'm not quite sure. Um, i tell you the truth, I'm not really sure what my guys are doing. Yeah, it looks like I need more wood. Alright, hold on. So just take all this stuff out. Uh, remove resources. There you go. Take this out as well. Take this out. Alright, go for it. Okay, I think if you right-click, it gets the item off your screen. Like, if I wanted to make a barn, boom, I made a barn, right-click. Okay, there we go. Alright, stuff is happening again. Uh, I don't know what the people are doing here. You know, we should probably take off a couple gatherers. I just need the food, though. You know? I can't take off those gatherers. Gotta get this thing built, too. We just don't have any wood. You know, that's the problem. Alright, they're doing their thing. Oh, it looks like they're going to be building this thing out here soon. 
You know what we should do? We should make a stockpile over here so they don't have to waste their time. So let's uh, let's go ahead and make a... stockpile right here for the trees so that way they could just cut down the trees put them in the stockpile and just keep cutting them down hopefully that'll help all right the storage barn is going so that's pretty good um, we do have tools how come they're not using tools oh because they were probably children I'm trying to click on one of these people But you. Uh, okay, they do have tools. Okay, good. Well, eventually you have to replace those tools. They do degrade. Alright, so... We are cutting down trees. Those logs are all being used to build stuff right now, though. Um, our food is starting to come in a little bit faster. We have stone and iron. We don't have a lot of wood. I'm not going to cut down too many trees over here, though. Uh, I'm just going to cut down all these. Yeah. Now, why are you going this way? What are you doing? You're working? Close, educate, labor. Where, where are you going? There's a way to tell where they're going. I forget where. Center the view on the citizen's home. Uh, view on the selection. Follow? There's a way to see, like, where they're going. I'm not sure where she's going. Let's see where she's going. Let's follow her. Alright, she's putting her stuff in this stockpile. Why didn't she put it in this stockpile? Does it have to be made? Maybe the tree has to be removed? I'm not sure. Alright, I guess it's not that big of a deal. And there goes the woodcutter. Alright, so the woodcutter now has everything they need. They're just It's just waiting for builders. And uh, it's going along. We're getting some logs now. Okay, once this is full, uh, the woodcutter... I need to put on some woodcutters. Oh boy, it's getting cold. Oh, look at the deer. Alright, so we need woodcutters. Let's, uh... Woodcutter, woodcutter. There we go. And now we have a woodcutter. Now they should cut wood into... They should cut these logs into... Firewood. Whoever it ends up being. There they go, they're cutting it. Look at them go. And now we have some firewood. Somebody get that firewood and put it in that house. Where's that firewood going? It's not being... There we go, it's in the house. Okay. Alright, and our food is actually looking pretty decent. Um, we got ten people, so someone had some children, because now we have seven children. It's early winter. Uh, most of these trees are gone over here. Which is fine. Uh, I don't know if I want to clear over here. I'm not sure if hunting cabins have to be in the woods. But I'm going to stay away from the hunting cabin for now. Uh, let me see. Where do we want to expand? Can't expand up here. Can't expand up here. We're just expanding over here. Uh, one thing we can do for wood is there's, uh, there's a certain... Um, cut this tree down. What the hell? Remove, damn it. Well, that's a stockpile. How do I get rid of the tree? Alright, that stockpile might have been a mistake. Let's see if we can remove it. How do we remove this? There we go. Alright, whatever, it's fine. Alright, so let's go ahead and bring this up and let's remove all the resources that are still left in this area. Now there was actually a bunch of our stuff down here we could have harvested as well. 
you can see these little things right here. That's what you would have, um, that's what your, uh, your whatchamacallit would have got. That's what your gathering hut would have got. And the gathering hut is worth its weight in gold. Look at that, man. Just a ton of food. Um, but it's not enough. We really need to get this built. I don't know. It's taking a while to build that. Let's, uh... Hmm. Well, we do have some logs stored up. We do have some firewood. But we need to get this thing built. I'm not sure how to force people to build this. The number of citizens working at this location click to select another cycle to workers. I don't... Yeah. Well... Let's put three builders, see if that helps. And then we will come over here and remove this stuff. All of this stuff. Alright. Uh, we're going to need one more thing before I end the video. Uh, there's, Like I said, there's a... There is a structure that will grow trees for you and then cut them down. Uh, resource production? A woodcutter? No. Forest lodger. Used to define an area to selectively cut down trees and plant new seedlings. That's what we want. Now, where do we want this? Um, I kind of want this for regular expansion, but I don't know. Let's see. Mm, that's a lot of wasted room. Because... Of the freaking water, you know? Yeah, because of the water and like where I am, that's kind of a lot of wasted room. Yeah, I'll just put it down here. Screw it. And then we'll build a road to it. Uh, we should have a road. And let's swing around. There we go. Alright, now why isn't this getting built, man? This is like... It's like they don't even think about it. Not quite sure why that's not getting built. Okay, seriously, why is this not getting built? I have builders, I have materials, nobody's bringing them over there. Maybe because they're cut maybe because they're using it for firewood. All right. Either way, uh, that's going to be in this video. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy this game. I really do enjoy it. Um, there's still a lot I have to learn. Any of these kind of games where you set tasks and want your uh, your you know little guys, your minions, your you know people to do it is always a little tricky. So uh, you know I'm going to continue this let's play though. I hope you guys enjoy this game and um, there's going to be many more. So that's going to be it for episode one. I'll see you next time for episode two. Till then, take it easy.